What's up, guys? Welcome back to uh, Summer. So, um, I'm not going to waste any time with this one, and uh, we're going to get on with it. Um, right, okay. Ah. There we go. So cool. Anyway, we can all go that way, but I'm gonna see what's up here. It's a door that is being blocked up. Find the shuttle to land there. Thought it was gonna open then. Find the shuttle then. Let's go. We have lights. Where did I get a flashlight? Uh, yeah, I could. Thinking the exact same then. Uh, but nothing seems to be here. Nothing, no. Nothing down there. Oh. No. Right. Uh, came from that way. This way. There's a data buffer, but it doesn't seem to be on. Or whatever it's called. I can't actually remember. Oh, okay, I just lose it there. Fish. Well, they've been affected by that weird blue stuff as well. <laughs> Thank you for the lights. Not oh, that it's so dark. There's a buffer. Fish, good to know. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna take it that you're not friendly. I'm gonna go this way. Nothing there. No, you don't. Do that, sir. Robot, whatever the hell you are. Nope, I ain't waiting for shit. <laughs> I 
take it your yeah. Oh yeah. That's all I'm gonna be not be gonna be so alone after all. Hello buddy. Let's do this. Got to take on the world together. Oh, what's left of it? Is that a crab? There's a crab. <laughs> Mate, it's crab. Look, where'd he go? He ain't interested in Done one big loop. Maybe, maybe not. Oh! No, you don't. Just, yeah, so that was definitely where I came from. So let's uh, not go that way. Station up zombie. Yeah. Oh my well, thank you, dude. Huh. Thank you. Well, thanks, little guy. In better days. Oh, uh, already got it on. Jackie, come in, Theta. Are you okay? What? I can't. Where are you now? Strasky, I'm at the shuttle, but it's not looking good. The lights flicker like mad. I, I think the power regulator is broken. I have to fix it. I don't want to get stranded halfway to Theta! What was that? I can't hear you! Don't worry, I'll fix it. Somehow. Oh. I guess I can get into that. Thing, is it? Uh, ah, ah. Jesus Christ! What the hell? 
Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Just fucking suck me in. Oh, it's a little guy. Manifest. First, I'm knocking everything over now. Impact event. That's how it happened. Huh. Interesting. I guess that's a good thing we never had any kids. Hard enough looking my parents in the eyes. They're going to a bomb shelter upstate, by the way. Along with your dad. I'm guessing someone will help him send you a message somehow. I mean, I hope they will. Hell, I'm not even sure you'll get this message. If you do, I want you to know I never blamed you for following your dreams. It just, I was just mad it didn't fit better with what I imagined our lives would be. I really wanted the picket fence, big family, you know. I guess what I'm trying to say is I'm proud of you. And even though it's been difficult to be separated from you, I regret nothing. I'm happy. And I really wish I was able to say this without the sky falling down. <laughs> I love you, Amy. I always have. And always will. Man, that's rough. Really is. I think that's it for that. Forgotten how, like, much this game just throws you in with the real shit. What we can do about this power. Right, go that way, I can tell you that much for it. Not that like tiny tight gaps. Disgusting. It's like a machine like coral. Fixing the power. I was going to Theta. Anything I can do? If you see Masters or Holland, tell them I need help. Okay? Amy needs help. Come on. I feel like I know exactly what I've got to do, but I just don't want to. I don't have to find answers. And again, I can't exactly leave you like this. This isn't exactly a world life worth living, is it? <sighs> I'm sorry. I truly am. I swear to God, if this isn't one of those things that I'd like, I just had to not like torture the hell out of that coral. But you're an actual human. Kind of. No! Shit. Are you okay? Ugh, come on. Don't leave us up running along. Oh, fuck. Yeah. That's what I was thinking. Sorry, Amy. At least she could be with your other half now. <sighs> anyway. 
not that. It's a moment of silence for Amy. See what we can do here and now. We have power. I go in here. Nope. I don't think there's much way down there. I think I've got everything in here. Let's move on. Okay. Ah, thank you. Shuttle chase six activated. Standing by. Let's get a move on. Do I have to flick any switches? Aha, I do. I don't know if you're professional. Lambda. Let's go. And away we go. Oh, we're not gonna lie, but it's gonna be a little screen. Welcome to Pathos 2, your expressway to the stars. What started as a thermal mining operation in the 60s has now become home to the Omega Space Gun the world's most affordable way to launch satellites and deep space probes. Our unique Atlantic Ocean location allows for this gigantic coil gun, running longer than a marathon, to safely launch projectiles without risk of damaging the payload with risky combustion. The station stands multiple sites and has a diverse staff of engineers and scientists. Together they are able to produce, assemble, and launch the world's most sophisticated spacecrafts. In addition to our principal operation, Pathos 2 is also the home for multiple research projects within the marine sciences, including hydroculture, turbulence, and deep sea construction. We are now leaving Upsilon for Lambda. Lambda is Pathos 2's shipping dock and transportation hub. There, you will be able to find shuttle trains leading to all the other parts of the station. A little bit good here, there, towards the end, buddy. Oh, what's up? Uh, what do you mean? Oh, yes! Shit! You would have thought this thing would have hit the brakes quicker. But at least it told me, you know. Could have just been like, you know. Feel that one later on, yeah. I'll be feeling it now. Uh, about that? Hey, thought it would come in handy. I don't actually have to use it though. You can do with a butthole right now. I don't know why I did that. Yay! So the effort was there. What is that? Is that like a phone or something? It is. Hello, hello. Simon. Simon, are you there? Catherine, is that you? I was on my way, but then the shuttle train, it, it fucking crashed. Are you alright? The system says the section is sealed for a suspected hull breach. No, I'm not alright. What the hell happened to the world? Why are we underwater? Well, you're really out of place, aren't you? Look, don't worry about that right now. I realize you're confused, but you're so close to Lambda. If you just keep going. How close? Can I walk there? Yeah, but the tunnel is locked off to protect the overall structure from collapsing. What you need to find is your section's maintenance hatch. It'll lead outside. Maintenance hatch. No problem. What is that? What's going on out there? I gotta go. See you soon, Simon. Catherine? You okay? 
Okay. I did not have the microphone button, but what is that man? I don't know. Is that an alien butthole? I see. Health. It is. Give me the heels. Got the Omni tool back in the shuttle. Oh shit. Oh, hold on. So I'm just focus on one crash. I don't even really think about the bloody tool. I like that though. Oh. What the hell is that? Okay, then that wasn't hard fighting at all. Just grab the tool and let's get on. Get move on. Don't want to be hanging around here anymore, time. Not that weird teleporting weird things here. I'm gone. See you later. Doesn't take up most of our planet or anything. Nah. It's just a day's walk. No step on the grabs. Lambda, 350 meters. It's a little bit of a walk. Lambda, there we go. Some chairs. I thought I saw something interesting. Nobody asked you, Roxy. Uh, 
Lambda. Well, that's something. Let me go see what this is first. There we are. Oh, whatever. Don't bother. See if this door will open. This, this must be Lambda. Where Catherine is. Access granted. Hello? Catherine, you hear me? Hello, ha. Housekeeping. Took a hard hat, you know, keep my head safe. Yeah, if it was there, okay. Go on, Catherine. I think I'm dead. Don't think you'll notice. I'll just dive in here. If I say it was a heat, it had some. It had a bit of a rack on it. Did say don't look at it. Let's just let's just camp out in here for a minute. Are you sure you're not about to just leave me right into this thing's face? I'll take it it's safe. Oh, hello. I'm hurt. No, not you too. I was really hoping you were human. Don't let the circuitry fool you. I was human once. Can't take any more. This is... Everything's fucked. I give up. There's nothing left. Calm down. It's not the end of the world. You sure? It sure as hell looks like it. For all I know, there's no one left except for me. What do you mean? I'm right here. Don't take this the wrong way. But I meant any humans left except for me. Have you looked at yourself lately? You're a walking, talking diving suit with some electronics left on for good measure. I don't... You don't want to think about it? We'll start thinking about it. I, I, I don't want to do this anymore. I don't want to be this. I want out. Before you do anything hasty, could you help me with something? What? I was trying to find out what happened with my project when that brute knocked me to the ground. Your project? How could anything possibly matter when you know you're a stupid robot in a stupid dead world? Okay, focus. I need you to fix me so I can get back to work. Then you can sulk as much as you want. You gotta be kidding, right? I think I have a better chance of building myself a time machine than of putting you back together. I just need to access the computer. Oh, is that an Omnitool you're carrying? Oh, the door opener? I picked it up at Upsilon where I woke up. I don't have to do. Plug it into the terminal. Sure, whatever. Oh, chill out, when the Omnitool is loaded, just plug my Cortex chip into the tool. What's a Cortex chip? It will be obvious. I'll eject it for you. Just grab the chip and slide it into the Omnitool. Come on, I just need you to do this one thing for me. Sure, whatever. Lambda Terminal 27 activated. The Omnitool is ready now. Should be easy enough. Just pick up the chip and slide it into the Omnitool. Why does a robot chip fit a door opener? It's standardized connect. Uh, Catherine? Alright, let's give this a try. Let's do that. Custom 
Cortex chip found. Shutting down helper chain. Have a nice day. Just pretty much anything will fit. Oh, this feels weird. I'm in the Omnitool? Thanks. So, what's the project about? My project? Oh, well, I saved all the people on the station as brain scans and put them into an artificial world. We were going to launch it into space to save it from, uh, well, all of this. Are you telling me that you were going to launch a computer world filled with people into space? Yes. It was just a pet project at first, but it got really serious after the comet took out the surface. Then suddenly it became very important, and it was officially named the Ark. That's appropriate. How far did you get? I don't know. That version of me that I am. It came from a scan I did pretty early on. The living Catherine could very well have finished the project and launched it. I guess she could even still be alive. Uh, weird thought. So the talking robots, are they also scans you did? They could be, but I doubt it. I'd expect much more sense if that was the case. Ah, all right, filing. What's happening? I managed to restore some data from the backup server. This should tell us everything we need. Oh. Could you do me a favor and run into the other room and have a look? I don't seem to be able to view the files in this condition. I need to know that the Ark is safe. Sure, Kath. Thanks. I'll unlock the door for you. Well, thank you. What was it you said before? You're from Toronto? Yeah, I just went in for a brain scan and suddenly here I am. That doesn't make any sense. How? Why would anyone bring a scan from Toronto? You think that's strange? What if I tell you it was back in 2015? Whoa. Yeah. Yeah, whoa. She's in other room, but she didn't specify which one, so. Let's take a wonder. Is it a bit. Is it just in the. What are you doing? Be careful! That's not me. Uh, you quite done. You done. Go on. Chew. Careful! I think it's back. Keep your eyes peeled. I don't think it's any with me, maybe. Hope not. You say something? Sorry, still trying to figure out how you got here. Keep at it. I'd really like to know who thought sending a Canadian to the bottom of the sea was a good idea. I think I'm gonna keep that one saved. Please get injured. What happened before? That creature was strangely overbearing. Yeah, it basically exploded with electromagnetism. That's confusing at least. Gives the senses a good punch. Pills. Hard hat and a bubbles. Uh, just a bubbles. Oh, hang on. Shiny. Damn shame. There's really no way around this. A freaking comet killed the planet. Afraid so. You were all stranded down here. And we were the lucky ones. Nah. Personally, I would have said the lucky ones were the ones up on the surface. This is a no life work living. Uh, oh yeah, there's rooms down here. Oh yes, there is. Just 
Just check the computer. Yes, look for anything about the Ark. Are you excited about the Ark? At first, I couldn't really see the point of it. Why shouldn't we, right? I mean, if we are able to save even just a small piece of ourselves, why wouldn't we do that? So you are in favor of that. I think it's really important we do this. What are your thoughts on the Ark? It's a great idea. Finally, we have something to do. Am I right? Are you optimistic about the project's chances of... Um, about the Ark reaching space? Yeah, it can definitely be done. You already solved the biggest problem. How to actually get us all in there. Now all we have to do is build the damn thing. And hope Phi is still operational. Yeah, I think we can do it. But it's not gonna be easy. the art project? The idea is uh, just incredible by every definition. <laughs> it really makes you think about what it means to be human. What makes you say that? Beyond the basics, beyond the superficial, I'm convinced there's something with even greater value. You have provided a platform which is not necessarily restricted to our digital progeny, but a means of actual survival. It's my sincerest belief that we can go on living through the reality of continuity. Hmm. Is this from inside the Ark? Yes. That's some early renders of the world inside. Looks a whole lot comfier than this place. A video or not. Take it to just the construction of the arc and its pathway, which it would take. Welcome. If you are reading this, you have successfully entered the arc. This is the survey is designed to give the developers better understanding of your subjective experience and how to improve your well-being. Please continue with this survey. How would you describe your physical condition? I feel normal. I feel invigorated. Better vision of myself. I feel alien. I'm a visitor inside another's body. I feel fake. I no longer feel like a real person. Uh. Feel normal. Screw it. How would you describe your mental condition? I feel normal. I feel disconnected. Separation of mind and body. I feel altered, a change in character, I feel lost, like I, I don't exist anymore. Well... I'd say that one. I would just describe your senses. As expected, normal. I feel more sensitive and aware of my surroundings. I feel blocked, as if my senses are numb. Well... Uh, I would say normal. How would you describe the sensation of your new condition? It's pleasant. I don't like it. Something's wrong. It's disconnecting. Everything feels constricted. Uh. Yeah, that one. Are you troubled by the fact that you're no longer strictly human? No, I'm fine. Somewhat, I feel like I lost myself. Yes, I'm more of my previous ex existence. That's what I say, experience isn't. It does not say that. Uh, I don't care what 
ball might take as long as I get to carry on. I do feel like this one, to be honest with you. So I would like to think if I was in the situation, I'd be like this, but. Anyway, next question. How do you perceive your new existence? direct continuance of my previous self like a new chapter in my life like being born all over again a complete do-over something completely different has nothing to do with my previous self uh i'd like to think this one do you think you're new do you think this is do you think this new existence will be a life worth living Yes, as much as my previous lives, yes, but with less meaning. I'd like to think this one, honestly. Would you rather be removed from the project and accept death? Hmm. I don't know. I really don't. I'm gonna go with no. Your answers have been saved, thank you for participating in the ARC team. Anyway, Ark Tracker, that's what I'm looking for. I found a tracker honed in on the Ark. Oh, that's clever. I wonder if I thought of that. Does it still work? I really need to know what happened to yeah, it. It works. I think so. <laughs> it's doing something at least. Where is it? Hold on. I'm trying to find it. Are you okay? Please let it be safe. Nope. Uh, down here? Nearly, but no. Uh, over here. No. This one? Also no. Up here? No. I could have sworn I put that in before. Not important. Uh, where am I? I'm here. I guess here. There it is. Oh Christ. Uh big room. Big room. Any more. I found it. No. It's at a site named Tau. Oh no, it's on Earth. It's so close to Phi, they almost made it. Damn it, it won't make it for long in that state. A couple of decades at most. That's not much to build a future. If we got to it. Could we get on the Ark? I suppose, but I'm not exactly flexible at the moment. Huh. Right. I'll take us there. I can move, jump, swim, sort of. You're stuck in the door opener, the Omni tool. I'll just carry you there and you'll show me what to do. That sounds really risky. Besides, I don't like the idea of you carrying me around. Come on, Catherine. This is what you wanted to do, your final mission. Let's launch the Ark. We would need to find a way to get into the Abyss. Can't take the Climber without a power suit. We probably have to go to Theta and pray the Dunbat's still working. Okay, so we go to Theta. <sighs> I don't know, it's pretty far. Catherine, look around. What else is there to do? You know what? I found a sunken vessel just outside. Bet that could take us to Theta. Really? Didn't look completely out of action. It even lit up a little when I tried the Omni tool on it. Okay then, let's have a look. I'll just eject from this thing. Don't forget to take me with you. I think you're attached to it. Rather crucial. What happened to the tower? And the dock? And the welcome center? What tower? This place is in ruins. All the cash. Can I pull the Omni tool out? Wait, wait, wait. Oh. Okay, just be sure to plug me in again at some point. You got it. Good luck, Simon. Thank you. I did not mean to interrupt what they were saying. Can't change that now. All right, now we've got Catherine and our back. Let's go. Oh, that's a
Let us go. Emergency Vessel 4. Hey, Simon, can you hear me? I hear you. Can you get this thing running? Hang on, I'll give it a try. That sound good. Sorry, it's dead. Fuck. Worth a shot? The CV came from Curie. It was a ship that used to make runs between Lambda and Lisbon. Looks like their wreck is close. Maybe you can find a vessel like this one inside. Sounds like a plan. I'll just save the security information and update the Omni tool. There. Should help you get around. Great. Well, thank you, Catherine. Let's get a move on. Is that my friend? No, there's somebody else. I want to know where my little bubbly friend's gone. Follow the green lights, I take it. I thought that was some sort of body or something. Then. I'm not lie. Anyway. Tyler Shaw was making me do that. Let's get inside. Access granted. Heave. Well, this place is seeing bad days, Jesus. Anything, anything. I don't know where I am. Oh, there's a hole over. Then, yeah, let's go. It's like jump straight past the ladder. Go. in this one. Don't think we're going further over here. down there to just straight drop up into the darkness that's not horrifying at all 
Whoa. Nah. Let's go up, let's go up. I don't really want to set up this death staircase anymore. Let me in. Oh, I just like punched my microphone. Apologies, that sounded absolutely hor horrible. Let's start her off into next week. Alright, we're in. Let's find a working escape vessel. Nothing, that's enough. Point. Uh right. SCP-096, don't look at it. Oh, don't look at his face more accurately. Let's save that to fellow here. Yeah. I guess I need it. safe up here but I might not be uh right start his toilet hey the layout that layout of this thing is absolutely confusing there's a shuttle if we can't get this thing moving. Uh, ah, uh, wait, what? Safety locks are blocking the vessel's release. Are you oh, kidding? So. How much more of an emergency could this ship be in? It's on the bottom of the sea. 
Take a look at the engine room and see if you can figure it out. Maybe there's an override or something. There's monsters out there. Like the ones we saw at Lambda. The more reason to get going. What? Come on, you know the drill. Don't look at them or get too close. It'll mess with your circuits. Ah, oh, shit. We need to get out of here. I know, I know. I'm going. Let's get out of here then. Rip cage, nice. New pair of jeans. Thing trying to hunt me down and scare me and kill me, but please, I should do. Aha! Right, this is what's keeping the power on. Better stop getting plugged in. Even know what direction we're going in. Don't worry, I'm hooked up to the navigator. We're headed for Theta. Should be a matter of minutes. I thought I was done for back there. Seems like the Wow was keeping the Curie from going into a catastrophic failure state. I, I mean, how did it get on the ship? Are you talking about the black tentacles in the engine room? I've seen them before at Upsilon. What are they? They're a manifestation of a malfunctioning station-wide artificial intelligence called the Wow. Station-wide? So we just made a powerful enemy. No, no, it's not like that. The AI isn't a persona. It doesn't feel or think like we do. It's more like, uh, it's more like a cancer. Lovely. Was that the ship? Looks like your sabotage worked better than expected. Oh, no. Brace for impact! Hold on, the blast just pushed us off the plateau! What does that mean? If I don't hit Delta, we're dead. Oh, lovely. Please remain 
succeeded. Again. Hey, buddy. Well, thank you. Oh, hey, little guy. Didn't expect to see you again. <laughs> Thanks. Don't worry, Cat. I'll find a way to Theta. <laughs> At least there's more blood, blood here. At least there's more bright here. Body crab. So I think that's a spider crab. Got like four claws, isn't it? Not important. Do it. Do it with some heat left. A bit of water, buddy. Uh, this seems important, little guy, doesn't it? You might be right. Are you right there? I don't think it's got anything to do with me either. Not really. That's the other one. Uh, how are the day? Am I right? Can't believe how much I'm sweating in this suit. That's all awesome. Hey, could you maybe help? I need to get the theta. Don't worry about it. I got this. Listen. Don't stand there. You know better than that. Hey, can you hear me? Help me out of here, will you? I think you can't hear me. <sighs> she can need some vacation, sir. I'll have to speak to me. Alright. Got a nice vacation, sort of charred of a charred planet. Do you help me out with this, buddy? Yeah, you can. Good robot. Thank you, little buddy. Probably should come up with a better than a little buddy, but. Uh. I did absolutely nothing. Hello. Oh. You've seen better days, haven't you? Your face, what happened? You saw Akers fucking injecting that shit into them? He got me pretty bad. I think I made it worse pulling away. I, I can feel it bleeding out. Can you see him? Fuck. He got on the Zeppelin. He's going back to Theta. We have to warn them. Good luck with that. The platform radio is dead. Remember? The Lumar Annex should work. It has to. Yeah. You go. I'm not gonna make it. I'm just not. Come on, Evans. We have to warn him. Come on. Rough, dude. Yes, he did dock in the end. Anyway. What's this, lad? Go to R. Oh, thank you. 
Okay. Good God. Healing. Just stick it in there. UH manual. Ah, KB, that's your name. <laughs> that's the bulb. Medium marker. Interesting. Messages. Terry, it's been decided that you and your crew will evacuate to Theta on the 14th. Everything is being taken care of and you will all be given new positions as you arrive. You will have to fall into the ranks, of course. The last thing we need is more leaders. Fuck you, Kronstead. I'm not going anywhere. You don't have the authority to make me, Terry. This isn't my order, you idiot. I'm just a messenger. You want to stay? I could buy you some time if you want to hang out at your dump. But your crew is moving tomorrow. Mr. Ackeries, that's how you said it. I'm happy to inform you that your crew has safely arrived at Theta. Let me know when you are ready to move. I'll send a transport. Peter Strasky, Theta Dispatch. Merry Christmas, Mr. Ackers. Ackers? I really don't know how to say that word. Don't hesitate to ask if you want to be re relocated to Theta. Peter Strasky. Cocked up a few words then, but don't matter. Uh, why would I want to play that? Would say the end of the world. The world needs my help, but the world already ended. I missed it somehow. Bathroom. What's in here then? Uh, not much. I don't think there's anything else that needs my interest in it. Working, it's not flooded. Ah, interesting. Wow, it's a ew. Well. Has to be relatively done because that's relatively fresh eyes. Painkillers. I wonder why I needed that. The light is hurting my eyes. He's telling me I don't need this. Victorious? Victorious? Flesh inside my skull to see salvation. I will gladly remove them. Stop them from. Obstigating, obstigating the divine mission. Okay then. That's 
fleshy. I think that's where he hid. Ew. It's exciting to watch the wild claim data. Half a year ago, I'd be worried. I have Goya and Juan clean the black blood from the machinery. Now its crusty surfaces seem to complement, even outshine what that was. Oh, there was my reflection in the black blood of our warden whispers. I need to save them from this hell. Let them sleep. Lock them in. Lucid dreams. I've seen. Creepy. Well then. Such a locker room. Not in a good way either. Oh, getting established. Huh. Eight forty. I'll put that in tomorrow. Well. Yeah, we are Probably for the best. Not sure I trust the shuttle train anymore. Never mind. Uh, maybe that's just not the right one we're looking for. Maybe there's any more on this channel. Sound a little bit fishy. Not, not saying that for a pun, but anyway. Hmm. I right, shot that one. I think I know what I'm doing. I think I'm going to come from here and over to this terminal over here. I think. Maybe. I don't know. Soon find out. Netherlands. Latest Island. Echo. I've established link. So it's not that one. I think it was on three. No. Four. No. Five. Next one's on seven, I believe. Shall this one? Uh, oh, it's incoming. Zeppelin's on its way. Gotta get ready. I do. 
Because I've just realized this guy's breathing. You're gonna try to kill me, are you? What though? That's definitely the sad one. There's a hot thing coming up in the distance. Gonna get out of here, little buddy. existence like that. Where are we now? Delta. At least that's what you said before the crash. Oh, right. Of course. Is this a Zeppelin? Appropriately named. You think it can get us to Theta? It's a cargo transport. They use them for moving materials between the sites, anything that's too big for the shuttles. I'm sure it can carry us. Ugh, why won't it work? Come on. Oh, the tool chip is bust. Isn't that part of the Omni tool? Look who's been paying attention. I have to deal with that back at Upsilon. Then you know how it works. We need to get a new tool chip and switch it. Care to point me in the direction of the closest tool chip storage? I think it would be easier to just take one from a robot. What? Just knock a robot over the head and steal their chips? The toolbox over there says it has a stun baton. You could use that. Come on. I don't want to hurt anyone. Isn't this a bit much? It's just a robot, Simon. We're just robots. Sort of. I'll get us a chip. Oh, come on. I don't want to beat anybody over the head with this. The robot feel things. I guess I have no choice. Great. I'm definitely not taking him out. Where's that other one? I'm not taking you out. No. No, no, no. Put that down, Simon. I can't do that to the little guy. Turn, turn, look. What's over there? I need you to open a door over there. Over here, look. I need you to open a door. I'm sorry, dude. Come on. I'm giving you your vacation. Oh, come on. Get rid of that crap. I hope this works. Better do. I'm sorry. Look, friend. I had to. No, come back. Please, I'm sorry. I didn't want to. Well, I'd rather have you hate me and you'd be completely fine. Because I couldn't hurt you. I wouldn't hurt you. <sighs> you happy now? Thanks, Simon. Don't be mad, okay? We really needed that chip. We we'd be stuck here. Could you do it? Kill a robot like that? I get attached to them too. I'm not a monster. But in this case, it had to be done. He was talking. I mean, he was delusional, but he seemed sincere. Present. Yeah, well, I'm sure it's fine. Was he really that different from us? It's just beginning to sink in. I mean, really sink in. I'm a robot. Didn't we cover this already? I guess I've known ever since I woke up at Upsilon. I just keep suppressing it. Like my brain doesn't want me to think about it. It's really getting hard not to think about it. Yeah. Could you maybe hit that switch over there so we could get moving? Oh, yeah, sure. Thanks, you know, I wasn't talking or anything.
over here you have the pipe in the darkness over here you have complete black abyss with weird stuff and yeah I've been an excellent tour guide if you couldn't tell oh okay, the cries of the whale because that's how conversations work. What? Oh, sorry. I, I just can't stop thinking about what we've become. It's clear that we're no longer human. But then how can I feel like Simon? How can I feel like anything at all? I mean, technically, I don't have any ears, no mouth. Christ, it's a weird thing to think about. I mean, I'm making sounds. I'm still saying things. You sure are. Okay. Your new body most likely has senses similar to those you had as a human. And your mind, only knowing one way to perceive the world, superimposes that skill set on top of your new features. So my mind is covering it up, pretending nothing's different. If it didn't, you'd probably be incapable of interacting with the world at all. And the stress would either kill you or make you go insane. So I've found a good balance between awareness and ignorance. Does that mean I shouldn't think about this stuff, or are my thoughts actually making me cope? Could I tip the balance by suddenly gaining some insight and then go insane? I wouldn't worry about it. I mean, we have real things to deal with. Saving mankind, remember? Speaking of which, we're closing in on Theta. I'll eject the Omni tool. As always, don't forget to take me with you. Uh, Kath, before you go, the artificial intelligence you mentioned in the escape vessel? Uh-huh, yeah. The warden unit? The WoW. Is it the WoW's fault that we're like this? I mean, it seems like something an unreliable AI would do. I suppose it set the ball in motion, but it's not directed with purpose. <laughs> it's really complicated to explain how machines think, Simon. Concentrate on getting inside data, okay? See you soon. I guess so. Not three. I'm going to leave this episode here, so uh, I'll maybe do a third part, depends on how it goes, um, but yeah, hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll uh, see you in the next one, goodbye.